Hey guys, how you doing? It's bright. It sure is. You know the expression, no means no? Well today, that's what this video is about. When you say no, it means... No. Okay, how many times has this happened to you? If you're a woman, how many times have you been sitting at a bar and had some dude hit on you? You're obviously uninterested, you turn away from him, sip your drink, you're not responding to him. Or maybe you do, maybe you say, okay, I'm really flattered, but leave me alone, thank you. And he still keeps it up, he's still hitting on you. How many times has that happened to you? You're going through a drive-thru or you're in a restaurant ordering food. You order your food and he's like, would you like to have an apple pie with that, sir? This with that, that with that, and he's like, no. But they keep on, and keep on, and keep on. How many times have you been grocery shopping and had someone hit on you? Or you get that knock at the door. Somebody trying to sell you something. It could be food, vacuums, or even religion. You say no, but yet, they come back a week later. Okay, this one's actually from my wife, so if you guys don't mind, I'm going to have to change the voice for this one. When I'm laying in bed with Michael, and he's want to smooch, and I say, no. She's got a point there. There's no should be no for that one, too. What is with these guys that they think no means yes, or persuade me, or I'll ask you again in five minutes, because maybe, just maybe your no will mean yes then. No, no means no. It does not mean persuade me. Or when your kids ask you, Dad, can I use the car? Well, you got things to do. No! It don't mean every five seconds, Dad. Why? 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 Doesn't just go for getting hit on either, although that is a big one. If your friends try to persuade you to smoke or drink or even do drugs and you say no and... Really, guys? They keep at it. No means no. It can be a lot of things, you know. You're busy having a family thing that weekend, and you're the only one out of your friends that owns that truck. And a good buddy of yours needs you needs your help. In most cases, you will help him, but like I said, you're busy doing other things. So he calls up, "Can I borrow your truck to move some furniture?" He's like, "Sorry, no." Not this weekend. But yet, they never seem to shut up. They're always like, why, why, why? When are people, when is people going to learn no means no? Silence does not mean yes. Maybe later does not mean yes. Maybe not now does not mean yes. No does not mean yes. No means no. Yes means yes. That's it. And when you tell somebody no, you want to also add, does anything on my face that indicates I said yes? Because you didn't. You said no. There are no blurred lines. There is consent and no. Nothing in between that. So we ask you guys, when we say no, or even you guys say no to somebody, why do they always seem to think it's a maybe? Why do men, it's usually men, why do they think that no means yes and also persuade me? Because it does not, wow, the sun is really bright. Yes, it's hot. But when you say no, you mean no. No means no. When no you, exceptions. Well, you guys think about this. Leave a comment down below. Do you think no means maybe? No means yes? No means bug me until I say yes? What do you all think? The general idea of today's video, guys, was a little knock at the door again back about an hour, maybe two hours, it was about two hours ago. And it wouldn't be so bad if it wasn't the first time, but it seems like we get hit every summer with the same group of people at least five, six times. And every time we say no, we're not interested, no. Today was a little bit different though. Not only I said no, I meant it like I have all the other times, but they got rude. They told me, well last time we was here, we didn't talk to you, sir. 
we spoke to what we think is your daughter. You know, the 19-year-old named Elizabeth. I was like, she's going to tell you no, too. But you know what? Here. Here's Elizabeth. Third mistake. I have no problems with religion other than my own. I'm very interested in learning about other religions. The problem, however, comes when I ask a simple question and they don't respond the way that is right. They did not get rude before. I didn't think they were. They might have been. But they did, however, be... They seemed put off by my question, and I'm not okay with that. In our life, we sometimes don't want to have to say no, but we do. In some cases, when we say no, we don't really want to hurt nobody's feelings. But when we say no, we mean no. But in most cases, people don't understand that word, no. Me growing up as a kid, I didn't understand that word. And sometimes as an adult, I still kind of don't understand that word. Maybe we all do better in this world if we did. You know? What do you guys think? Well, guys, farmer spare is going on. We was going to start a fire in the pit, but we are holding off on that a little bit. Um, just giving it a couple more days. We had rain. Give it a couple more days, and Izzy is the only one out of this family that's going to go to Farmer's Fair. But boys don't want to go. And this time of year, you don't want to be anywhere near my town. It is a madhouse. I'm going to Farmer's Fair. It's going to be fun. I'm going to eat a funnel cake and run into people. Oh, God, I hope I don't run into my ex-boyfriends. I even heard they're going to have a, a stand down there selling fried bologna. Ew. Yeah. Ew. Talking about gas. But anyway, guys, my intros will stay. I'm going to use the same one until I get my green screen going. Then I'm going to make a really neat intro. And it's only going to be a couple seconds long. It's going to be a kind of intro. It's going to be like, boom, like that. Mm, I love my intros. <laughs> Tell you the truth, I wish I could make them long again. But I know long intros are annoying. I know this. Any intros? I just like the editing part. And we still got some Hollis Wing skits coming up. Uh, the Little Red Riding Hood is on the serious back burner because she's waiting for an outfit to come in and it's taking us good old time getting here. Basically, no means no. No does not mean persuade me. No does not mean yes. Yes means yes. Maybe means no. And no means no. It's not that difficult. I was sort of hoping getting my green screen up and going this weekend, but I haven't found it yet. And it's just one of them weekends. My town gets f compact with people when Farmer's Fair is here. I don't do crowds. I don't do Farmer's Fair. But anyway, guys, it is what it is. And what's your comments? What's your opinions about no means no? Let me know something down below. Until next time, guys. If you like today's video, hit that like button. If you're brand spanking new to my videos, subscribe. Sometimes we have okay videos. This may be one of them times. Until next time, come on, 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 come on. Let's just get out of here.